I've never been this nervous to film a video ever. Hello everyone! I hope you guys missed me. Today I have a haul from StyleKorean.com and I'm really happy to announce that we got into a K-beauty contest. This channel is actually up so you can vote for me if you guys like to, if you really like my videos and if you've been watching. Thank you so much for your support. It really means the world to me. And Style Korean sent this box to me so I could try these things out. I've tried pretty much every item in this box and I'm going to give you guys little tidbits and things to watch out for and I'll even give you guys links down below and if you'd like to vote for me that'd be really sweet. I'll also leave that down below. But let's get started. Okay, so we have this box. It came from Style Korea. It came with 11 products. 10 of which I have with me and one of which I couldn't really use because it wasn't the right shade for me. Okay, so we're going to get started with the first product. It is this product by 16 Brand. It is called the TNG Color Blue Aid Lip Balm and Tint. So this stuff is really, really nice. I'm actually wearing it right now and I've been trying this product out for a while. I think the packaging is super cute. And I really love this for the gradient lip. If you can't really tell from close up, I actually have the gradient lip on right now. So the tint is more of like a gel consistency and the lip balm part is really pretty and glittery, if you can see. But it doesn't show up on your lips and it's just a lip balm. It's a sanded lip balm. I really like the texture. It kind of smells like a gel and it lasts almost as long as the Labiote uh, wine tint if you have that this I will put the retail price here and it's available on style Korean if you'd like and I would give this a thumbs up I would definitely repurchase this but it seems like it's gonna go a long way good bang for your buck it has a lip balm too so you can just throw this in your bag and that's what I do when I go to school and yeah you're good okay next product we have the milk to foam by Neogen coconut milk cleanser and this is a pure mild cleanser that is supposed to be really good for moisture and it's a really big bottle on the website for style Korean it actually shows up with a pump but it does not come with a pump okay so don't let that mislead you the product smells really really good but it's not a too coconutty smell like not too strong it just smells like soap if that makes sense it's a really decent size. A little bit goes a long way because this product is very thick. Um, when I tried this out last night, I did like it. The only downside to this was that it does leave a soapy residue left on your face even after you pat it dry. But of course, if you use a toner and a lotion after that you should be fine otherwise this product gives a thumbs up it does exactly what it says and i felt like that my skin was very squeaky clean even when i did the toner afterwards there wasn't much makeup left over and things like that so very good product next product is definitely my favorite product from this haul it's the huxley secret of sahara mask oil and extract and it says great things never came from comfort zones this is definitely out of my comfort zone. You guys know I love sheet masks. I have so many reviews on sheet masks. But this one particularly is really, really interesting. I even had to look up a guide to see how to use this because I was not very sure. But once I looked up the guide and I looked at the instructions on the back because they're only in Korean, I found this product very fascinating. The mask is actually really good quality. It's very almost silky and I felt like it smelled really really good like a sunflowery essence or just like flower essence and after 17 minutes of this on my face my skin was so nice and I woke up this morning and I just felt like I didn't have to wear makeup to go to school today and honestly this is the one product I really really recommend if you are interested in buying any of these products it's just amazing and it came with three in one pack if you guys were wondering and this is what the pack looks like you just squeeze the bottom pack into the top pack which I thought was like a very interesting concept and 
Yeah, I really recommend this. Good job, Huxley. This is a really good quality mask. And I felt like if you had a special occasion or something, these would be great because you can just put it on the day before and your skin will look radiant and glowy. And yeah, I just, I really recommend it. It's really, really good. So next product, let's move on to another makeup-y related product. This is the Hamish Artless Glow Base SPF 50 PA++++. This product reminds me a lot of the Etude House Face Blur, if you've ever tried that before. I think that this is a little bit better, actually. Not only because it has SPF 50 and the other one only has 15, but this makes my skin look so, so, so glowy and so healthy, and it smells really, really good, and a little bit goes a long way. And I feel like if you were having one of those days where you have really good skin, but your skin looks a little bit dull, you can just pop on this baby over or under your makeup, actually and it will give you a really, really nice glow. I'm actually wearing it under my makeup right now, so if you were wondering what I had, that's what's giving me this glow. Really recommend this. It's a little bit more expensive than the Etude House, but I would still honestly buy this. I definitely recommend this if you have trouble with making your skin look a really glowy, but not oily, obviously. Yeah, this product's really good. Oh, and the scent is not very SPF scented. It just smells very florally and it's a little bit thicker than the Etude House one. Next product in the box I found very fascinating. I was really interested to try this and it's the SRB Stabilize Rice Bran Enzyme Powder Wash and this is just what it sounds like. It's a powder wash so it's a cleanser and it claims to effectively remove dead skin, skin waste, making the skin tone brighter. And I can definitely vouch for this product. It really does make your skin a lot brighter and more even toned. And a little bit goes a long way. And this is really good because it has it's good for all skin types. So for you girls that have combination skin, this will be really good because I have combination skin and I really like this. And the bottle is pretty big and you really don't need that much product. And I just love that this is such a new concept, but it actually does something. So I give this product a thumbs up. So next product is a hand cream, which honestly, I didn't think much of when I, you know, saw it in the box. But honestly, this is a really good hand cream. First of all, the packaging is adorable. It's this cute little pink bottle with some plants on it. And it smells amazing. It smells very clean and very healthy if that makes sense it is a cacao 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 moisture and mild cream but it sinks into your skin so so well and even like a day later your hands still feel really really soft like i've had people touch my hand and be like oh wow your hands so soft like what do you have on and i'm just like benton girl so i give this a thumbs up if you guys really want to try something really really moisturizing or you get really dry ashy like elbows this would be really good next product is a really interesting product it's a duo product by touch in soul sol this is called the metalist liquid foil and glitter shadow duo in the color margaret and this is a really beautiful like bronzy duo it basically has one side that's kind of like a little foils like it says in the um title and the other side is more of like a adhesive, but it's not sticky, so you can wear it on its own. And it's just so pretty and gorgeous. I think I'd love to wear this for maybe special occasions or one day when I want to look done up. And it's a neutral tone. There's definitely a lot more colors if you don't like this color, but honestly, I think this product would be really, really, really beautiful if you just put it on your eyelids. It'll look like you're really good at makeup, even if you're not. Um, I'll swatch it for you guys. This is the liquid side. As you can see, it's just a really pretty sheen, but it's a bronzy color. But when you layer on the foil, it just looks so magical. Oh, and the foil side also has a spatula, so it's not as messy. If you can see that, I'm just gonna put the foil right on top. And look at how amazing that looks. That's so pretty. 
um, also be careful because it will leave glitter all over your hands. I don't know if you guys can see the glitter on my hands, but just touching this will get glitter everywhere. Okay, the next product is this Wamisa, Wamisa, Wamisa. Um, Flower Organics Eye Essence Brightening Anti-Wrinkle. So I tried this last night and you basically just put it under your eyes and it helps prevent wrinkles and it brightens your under eyes. I'm not so sure about the brightening because I did only try this once or twice, but I can say it feels so nice under the eyes, especially after a really long day. I felt like it helped me like fall asleep faster. Even if you go like this, it does not tug under your eyes and it's really nice and you're never too young to start preventing wrinkles. So I would give this product a thumbs up too. Okay, the next product is came with a bunch of little samples and goodies. It's by Pyung Kang Yul and the full size product you got is the Essence Toner. This is a really good toner. I really like it. A little bit goes a long way and the packaging is so simple and chic. And it came with a bunch of samples in a bag. Like how can you be mad at that? It's just a nice product if you want to try a lot of little things and see what you like, what you don't like. And it's probably really, really good for those of you guys that don't want a lot of chemicals or grossness in your skincare. Okay, and the last product, but not least, is the Thank You Farmer True Water Deep Serum. And it's for all skin types and it's hydrating. First of all, the packaging is adorable. It has these cute little raindrops on it. There's English and Korean on it. And the bottle is so cute and it has that kind of like suction pump so when you pump it the the product goes up so you can use all of the product and this is one of those items that I would definitely repurchase because it really does keep your skin moisturized and I feel like it's calmed my skin skin down because I've had really oily skin because it's been summer and I felt like this just helped keep my oils from getting too oily if that makes sense and when you put this on, it does leave your skin a little bit tacky, but it does go away if once you tap it in enough and it dries completely. And I would really recommend this for you guys to have combination skin, obviously, because you have dry and oily skin. I feel like this balances out the pH in your skin. And it's a very simple product. It comes with a pump. So I use two pumps on my face because I have a big face. And I really like it. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any thoughts on these products or if you have any questions. I will also link all of the products down below. That way you guys can see more research and stuff. That's one thing I like about Style Korean. It, they leave a lot of information so you can figure out how to use products um, in their description. And it's almost like my safe haven since Mimi Box start, stopped selling. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Takayo! Don't forget to vote. Mine is a little bit dirty, sorry guys. Um, I need a burp. Ooh, I just made it glitter everywhere. That was not a good idea. And honestly, guys, this is a really, really, really good toner to toner. So that's all the products in the box. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> okay. That was not planned.